Hello Year 10, uh, today's uh, little video is looking at atoms and elements. Um, just a short video really just to go through and just to clear up exactly what we mean by these words. Um, okay, now atoms are essentially the building blocks of substances, they're very, very tiny particles. Um, they are made up of other subatomic particles which we'll go into in a bit more detail when we look at the structure of an atom. Um, but essentially for today they are the building blocks of substances. Um, another word I want to look at is the word element. Now element or an element consists of atoms with the same atomic number. Now if they have the same atomic number, again we'll go into this in a bit more detail, um, but an atomic number is essentially the number of protons. So all atoms in an element have exactly the same number of protons. So if I was, for example, to have a look at some carbon, okay, it's an element, it's found on the periodic table. All of the atoms within that, that sample of carbon in there would have the same number of protons. Okay. Now these differ from compounds, uh, and on the, the diagram you can see there, I've got a, a very basic representation of a compound to the right hand side. A compound has different atoms that are chemically bonded together. Now within this representation, I've, I've just used different coloured molymods, uh, blue and white ones, just to represent that they are different atoms. We have two of the white ones that are bonded to one of the blue ones, okay, chemically bonded, different atoms, and that's our compound. Now a compound we don't find on the periodic table. Now a compound could be something like iron sulfide. We know this is a compound because it contains two different substances. It contains iron, which is given the symbol Fe, and sulfur, which is given the symbol S. It is made of two elements, Fe and S, but they are chemically bonded together, so they make a compound. Now, as I say, compounds are not found on the periodic table, which is essentially a collection of all of the elements. However, they contain elements that are found on the periodic table. 